Look, boys, I know you should be dressing for yourself and not for other people, but let's be honest. I'm here to, to really uncover what's underneath. And what's underneath all of us is that well, we want to impress our crush. And specifically, we want to impress beautiful women. I'm here for you, boys. And what I did today is I compiled a list of 10 items that if a beautiful woman sees you, and chances are that girl's going to turn right back around and walk away. I don't want you to miss out on that chance. Today, I'm going to show you 10 clothing items that just irritates attractive women. Number one. Girly bracelets. No, it's not trendy or cool. You look feminine like a schoolboy. Even if you are in school, remember, girls want to see you as a guy that's serious and that looks older than his actual age. Wearing childish accessories just doesn't cut it. You need grown man jewelry like a timepiece or accessories. This is why I recommend something like this, a minimal necklace. Number two, nerdy backpacks with suits. Shoot, this is irritating to me because you shouldn't even be wearing backpacks with suits as it is. You go to the airport, you'll see this at least a hundred times, a hundred guys doing it, which is such a shame because you have so much talent, so many pretty women around you that you could have probably hit on, but you're wearing that. As a man, you want to adopt leather accessories. This is why I always recommend you guys go check out our sponsor Mahi Leather because the misconception is that leather goods are crazy expensive. They're not. With Mahi Leather, you have handmade leather goods, top of the line, the leather is crazy supple, but they're affordable. Like, crazy affordable. If you guys click the link down below, you can see just how affordable they are. One bag that I hands down recommend is their duffel bag. This is the first bag that I bought from Mahi Leather. The bag feels like it should be a thousand dollar bag. The cool part is that when you order the bag, since it's handmade to order as soon as you place the order, you can actually get it customized. I put my initials on it because I think it looks pretty cool. It makes the bag look more expensive than it is. If you guys want to check out Mahi Leather, there's going to be a link down below with the special code so you guys can check them out. Remember, this makes an amazing Christmas gift that you can order now. Especially if you get it customized with their initials, whoever you gift these bags to, they're going to think you probably spend hundreds if not thousands of dollars. They're going to love you for it. It's a freaking win-win and something you, as an attractive dude, should definitely invest in. Number three, Air Jordan. All the freaking time. Like, I get you're trying to impress the boys and all, but pulling up in these won't get you far with women. And I'm speaking from experience because I see Jordans like expensive cars. Many guys, including myself, think that when you buy a supercar, you're just going to have hot girls throwing themselves at you. The reality? You just got a bunch of dudes telling you nice riding and how much did you pay for it? Save your money and invest in at least one pair of smart shoes like these that you can impress women with, that elevates your status and makes you an attractive man. Number four, sports sunglasses. This is the most unflattering style and shape of sunglasses because these are built for sports, to wrap around your head like the Terminator so they can protect athletes against the sun's rays. Wearing them daily makes you look like Robocop. What you need are designer frames are frames that have shapes to them that actually structure your face shape and not just cover one third of it. This is why if you go to a store like Jade Black, it's great where you can go to a test guide, fill a quick questionnaire and see what glasses you should wear for your face shape that's going to make you more attractive and stylish. But sports glasses, they're a no-go. Are you freaking taking notes right now, boys? I'm speaking truth right now. Like, are you making a list? Are you checking it twice? Have you been? All right, I'm, I'm going overboard, but you get the point. You need to be taking these notes down because I know it's a lot. This is why I tell you, ShopTagger is an app you need to download on your phone. As you watch these videos, every time I'm telling you something, you can go online on your phone and start tagging these items. Now you can make lists, and then ShopTagger is going to notify you when that item goes on sale and even let you know if there's any coupon codes available at checkout. ShopTagger is a free app and something that I use daily and I recommend to you guys. Literally the other day I got a DM from somebody telling me how with ShopTagger they saved like 10 bucks on an item that was 40 bucks. That's what ShopTagger lets you do if you have it on your phone and it's a completely free app and especially now for the holidays with all the holiday shopping and lists that you need to make, this is the app you need to have on your phone and to make things sweeter you can share lists. Meaning that if you have a list of things that you really want, share with your parents, with your friends or anybody that's asking what you want for Christmas, they got you covered. And, like I said, it's a free app. If you guys click the link down below, download ShopTagger so as you watch this video, you can tag all these items and you get automatically entered for a giveaway for a thousand bucks. Number five, baggy dress shirt. Women are savvy. They watch The Bachelor 24-7 so they know exactly how clothing should fit on models. And that's our freaking standard now because they watch that freaking show. A dress shirt is something that every woman wants to see her man in. It's just a staple of status. However, if you get the wrong fit, you're going to throw away all your potential to end up looking like this. 
Number six, still dressing like a teenager. Look, I'm all for comfortable style. However, I think there's a fine line from opting for comfortable fabrics that are more performance based and just looking like you're stuck in the past. It's a hard pill to swallow, but if you're over 18, you're a grown ass man now. You can vote, fight in the army, and should definitely start dressing more like a man. Women just expect it. Number seven, overly trendy clothing. You just come across like you're forcing too much to try to look good, especially if you're dripped in designer. This is very similar to that supercar scenario that I told you. You think you're gonna be impressing girls, but the truth is that the only eyes that are gonna be on you are from other males that are also hypebeasts that probably think you look cute today. Number eight, socks and sandals. On top of looking nerdy, women will 100% think that you are either self-conscious about your toes or just plain lazy. It's just confusing. Either cover your feet up with shoes or let your toes roam free and sandal. This half-assed lukewarm style will have chicks thinking that you're like that with everything else in life. Women are just done playing these mind games, boy. Number nine, sunglasses at night or indoors. This douchebaggery is only magnified when paired with a serious self-tan and a medium shirt that looked like you washed it twice before throwing it on. It's just confusing because I get that the frames make you look better. You no longer need the shade blocking that's meant to block the sun's rays and instead replace them for either prescription glasses or blue light blocking glasses that you can wear day and night without looking like a douche. You don't want to end up like T.I. wearing glasses 24-7. Finally, number 10, sports jerseys. I think that's more than enough. And that's basically it for this week's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to drop us a like down below. Also, boys, don't forget to subscribe and share this video. Help your fellow friends out, letting them know what they should and shouldn't be wearing to impress their crush. I did my job today, boys. See you next time.